You ready? You ready? Okay. All right, let's go. Weezer and... No, I'm sorry. Weezer and the Weezer and the Weezer. This door too. Wow. So Steve said this interview is going to define you. Don't let that <laughs> frighten you or anything. Well, it feels like we're uh, reaching out to a new market here, maybe. <laughs> the, old the older market? market? Yeah. Is, what you're trying to, is that what you're <laughs> trying to say? <laughs> <geezer part? laughs> Well, we have fans of all ages now. We've been around since 92, so yeah. we have some geezers in the crowd. <laughs> As well as their kids. You looking at me? Cool. You looking at me? Yes, he was looking at me. <laughs> <laughs> He's uh, actually got a ton of hits. Huge hits. And I was saying to you earlier that, you know, in Canada, you're, you said in Canada, you guys are probably bigger than you are down here. Yeah, per capita, I think for some reason we're, we're biggest in, in Canada they than anywhere else. They love you up there. Yeah, I don't know what it is about, about Weezer's music that works Boot, there. They relate. <laughs> yeah. yeah. You know, uh, the music business has changed. So, I mean, the last five years, you don't even recognize it from what it was before. How has that change affected you? Well, it's funny because at the heart of what we do, it's still exactly the same. I pick up an acoustic guitar and write a song, and we get together in the studio, we jam it out. And, and then from there, that's where it starts to get really different. Uh, people don't buy CDs so much anymore, so we're looking for new ways to get our music out there. And are uh, you involved in all that, or just be picking up the guitar? and? I'm, the I'm interested in the music business. I'm fascinated by it little frightened and excited by it, all the changes, just trying to be a little detached and say, okay, things are changing, let's roll with it. Uh, but most of my energy goes into the songwriting. Mm -hmm. But it was, it used to be, you released something, if it was hot, people went over to Tower Records and they, they mm -hmm. bought it, you know, how many you sold yeah. right away, etc. It's not like that at all. It's not, yeah. The rules of the game have changed. I remember when we started, uh, no one used cell phones. I'd call my manager from the payphone at the truck stop uh -huh. or, yeah. or communicate via fax at the hotel. Yeah. Wow. So it's a, it's a different world now. You know, and, you and now you've got music. You're doing a soundtrack for um, the uh, 3D, Jackass. That's what that was from? Yeah, our, our new song, Memories. We, we hooked up with our buddies from Jackass. It's funny. Steve-O. I saw Steve-O in it. Yeah. And I saw Zach Galifianakis too, which is great. Is it dangerous <laughs> to hook up with your buddies from Jackass? Well, actually, we knew Johnny Knoxville since before any of us were successful. Have you we tried part... his moonshine, by the way? <laughs> no, I'm okay. not, not sure what you're talking about. Well, but we used to play scary. basketball with them, and uh, PJ was just like the nicest, sweetest guy and never thought he would turn into this really? crazy person. But he person. was always like the good-looking guy who got the girls, I'm assuming? He, he was, but he was very hum humble and down-to-earth and sweet and kind. Part, part of the charm of Weezer, and, and please don't be offended, is that you guys look like this geeky group of guys that you, can, you put out this great music. Is that, is that okay to say that to you? When I say geeky, I mean like the nerdy kind of guy. Yeah, that's true. Um, it, but it's true that we rock pretty hard. Yeah, you it, do. It, yeah, if you see it. That's what I love about it. It's like the, the dichotomy of like the Buddy Holly glasses, and yet you rock out with your... Never mind, but... He wants to know. There's a compliment in there. If you do a remake of Buddy Holly, can he star in it? Is is basically what he would like. The video? Yeah. Oh sure. Yeah. 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 There you, you go. Nice. Ooh, you look so funny. Oh, that might not be so easy. Uh, okay, now, let me try this. Oh, uh, oh, uh, and I'm Mary Tyler Moore. The little things you can say and do like make you. me want to be. You look you. like a backwards oh, brother. Let's just take those off. I look great. And you know what? Backwards. You always look better. You look really good. Why do really I look good. like a guy who was kicked out of being a bad college professor? Geezer. Huh? So you guys have a surprise tonight? Are we supposed to give it away or not give it away? We're not supposed to give it away. You have to go to, to Axe. It's okay. Face no, nobody's watching. It's all right. A-X-E. Axe. A-X-E. Yeah. Facebook mm -hmm. for all the details after the show tonight. It's a, a secret show with lots of uh, really cool guests. We're, we're excited to be performing with these Ooh. other artists. Okay. And, uh, and you can't say who they are? Unfortunately, I can't say yet, okay. but I, I can tell you that I'm very excited to play with these people. Okay, so yeah. it's got to Now, you know who they are? Because yeah. when we say, hey, we have some exciting guests that's coming up, we never know. We're yeah. just saying Exactly. That. Yeah, well, that's how they got us into this. Right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're, we're really excited to play tonight. And it's in a very small, intimate venue. That's and all, all our friends, uh, all, all our fans have been trying to get the tickets to come to this. Oh, yeah, again, they have to go to... To get the tickets? Yes. yes. Well, the, the, uh, Axe has been tweeting these uh, different locations around L.A. that mm -hmm. all the fans rush to get the first one. Well, I don't know, 100 6 o'clock tonight on Facebook, the announcement, right? Not Actually, sure. I don't know. He doesn't okay. know, Steve. Leave 6 o'clock tonight on Facebook. Okay. Okay. Thank you.
Glad to help. Geezer. Thank you, Brother. Geezer, help Weezer. Geezer, help Weezer. Geezer is assisting our guests. Uh, the legendary, who you guys have sold Watch millions of albums, Geezer. Johnny Mathis has sold probably 50 million albums over the years. Can you believe that? That's amazing. Get one album that was on the top list for 11 years. Wow. Yeah. Johnny Mathis, thanks.